Connecticut. Close loss at home. Came here, obviously disappointed with both losses, both losses this season. What's going to be the difference to get the win tomorrow? Well, we've got to play our game. I thought we played our game in South Bend. We didn't play it here. The credit their defense. They played really well. We've got to do a much better job. We've got to be able to run our offense, and we've got to defend. All right. Thanks a lot. Beth, back to you. First appearance in the finals since 2001 for Notre Dame. And for the Huskies, they'll be looking for their 17th Big East Championship and a fourth in a row. Tomorrow night at 7 Eastern on ESPN, UConn and Notre Dame for Burke Weisbrook. Along with Allison Williams and our entire crew, I'm Beth Bowens. Coming up next on ESPNU, it's the Atlantic 10 women's final, Dayton and Xavier. This has been an exclusive presentation of ESPN. Your exclusive home for the Women's NCAA Championship. We are in the Saga Center in Lowell, Massachusetts for the Atlantic 10 Championship game. Top seed Xavier is in the final once again in a semifinal win over Charlotte. Senior Tashia Phillips led the way with 22 points and 11 rebounds as the Musketeers are going for their fourth tournament win in five years. Meanwhile, Dayton is in its first Atlantic 10 final. Kristen Doherty had a team high 16 points in a semifinal upset win over Temple. It's the Flyers and the Musketeers coming up next as they battle for the Atlantic 10 championship. It is championship week presented by Dick's Sporting Goods. This is the Atlantic 10 Women's Championship as the Dayton Flyers, the sixth seed, come in against Xavier, the top seed, who ran the table in the Atlantic 10 Conference this year, including two wins over Dayton.